Hello guys, in this video we will see how to install and configure DB Ever on Red Hat Enterprise Linux, then how to connect MySQL and PostgreSQL DB Ever tool. Click on activities, open Firefox, then go to DB Ever official website that is dbever.io. Click on download. Here we have two types of dbver softwares pro and community we are going to install community it is free of the cost now click on rpm debian package for the ubuntu or debian linux distros but rpm is for fedora centos rocky linux or red hat enterprise linux the process is same for all fedora family like centos rocky linux fedora and rhl click on it See, once we click the download has been started. So, wait until download completes and its size is 119 megabytes. See, download is completed. Now go to terminal. See, we have dbver rpm package. Now install by running sudo rpm hyphen i then rpm file name that is db ever and hit enter provide the password of sudo user there is a typo it is rpm we have successfully installed db ever now go to the activities then click on show applications search for db c we have db ever c c means community edition click on it wait it is loading it takes time because we have opened first time close this one close this one don't send see this is the db ever console now we are going to see how to connect to mysql click on this connect button that is new database connection click on it we have n number of applications if you are unable to find you have to search but mysql is there here click select it and click on next see and this is the server host name and this is the port number here we have to provide the database name let's verify the database name. show databases see i don't have databases create database now provide the database username is root you can provide the username from the mysql server but i'm going with root provided all the information then click on test connection now click on download see connected which means connection is success otherwise click on the details see here it is success click on ok click on finish now expand this server click on databases see we have the newly created database expand it expand tables see the table which we have created here okay the same way and the same way we are going to connect to postgresql server click on this new database connection then click on this PostgreSQL, click on next, default port is 5432, then provide the password of your Postgres user, user can be anything and databases, you can provide databases from the server, from the list of PostgreSQL server, then click on text connection, download see it is connected click on ok click on finish 
now expand this postgres expand databases see we have connected only the particular database right click edit connection if we want to connect to r2 schools database just change it can okay yes now expand now expand this see the database name has been changed expand schemas public schema then click on table see we have two tables let me connect to postgres equal and verify sudo system sudo su hyphen postgres psql slash c after schools slash dt see we have the same tables okay we also got the same okay now if you want to create a database right click on select create database you have to provide database name then owner name then template database you have to select from the list of the encoding and table space then we have to click on okay let me create r2 test i'm not going to change anything just click on okay see new database is added let's verify slash l c new database added so in the same way we can also create database in mysql server Just expand database right click on it and click on and select create and select database so okay like this we can create so in this video we have seen how to download and install db ever on red hat enterprise linux then we have seen how to configure db ever for postgres and ms postgres and mysql server then we have seen how to create a sample database in postgres equal server for more database videos please subscribe my channel thank you